Good morning, Starshine. The Earth says hello. Oh, hey, sassy queen. Hey, queen lady. Good morning, everybody. How is it going? My name is Jess. If you're, oh, oh, you're scratching me. Stop scratching me. Okay, here's another cat. Hello, cat. He cooperates. Oh, oh, never mind. This is the mother of the cat. Oh, anyways, today is going to be a very, very fun and interesting day. Get your tail away. I'm gonna be taking you through my day because we're doing something a little interesting. My dear friend that I have worked with, we have done uh, a show together uh, this past summer. We were in the Wizard of Oz together. She actually works at this uh, facial spa. So we're actually going to be going there and she is hooking me up with the vampire facial. And I have a super, super low pain tolerance. So this actually might be very traumatizing for me, but we're gonna find out. Okay, I actually looked up a review about Kim Kardashian getting the vampire facial, and she did say that she regrets it. So maybe, okay, no. We have to judge this fair and square. I can't really tell right now, but I, okay, let me just do like a little close up. I don't have great skin. It's not super smooth. It's incredibly oily. Um, I have lots of scarring down here. I always get acne on my chin right here around my nose. When I was growing up, I had red marks and acne all around my mouth. It was so gross and I have scarring from that. My forehead's actually been okay. So apparently this vampire treatment is going to help with that. I'm nervous. I might be in a lot of pain. Apparently it takes a couple of days to recover from it, but I'm gonna take you with me on my journey and we're gonna have fun. Even if I'm in so much pain, we're gonna have fun. So first things first, I need to get my Starbucks. So let's go. This Starbucks line is disgustingly long. I don't think this is gonna be fun. Oh, at least it's moving. Update, it's only been four and a half minutes and we're making progress. If you want a new Starbucks order, I'm obsessed with chais, iced chais only. And my favorite iced chai is the iced chai latte a venti with cinnamon dolce sprinkles, one pump of brown sugar, and vanilla sweet cream cold foam. It is to die for. The marquee is in sight. We are but two cars away. We can do this. Oh, we're moving up. We got her. She's Gorge, and I'm gonna devour her right now. I just had to film a video for a brand, and I'm super, super duper excited about it. So I had to beat my face one last time before it has to heal over this process of this vampire facial. Apparently, there's going to be lots of blood on my face, kind of like smeared on my face. I Google pictures and I'm literally terrified right now. Now you guys are probably like, Jessica, why are you getting this facial done? Your face looks like it's glowing right now. I put on lots of foundation and contour and concealer. So I have a lot covering up my face right now. So you can't really see any blemishes. And I also have a fierce lighting hitting my face at the moment. But I need to wash my makeup off now since I'm done filming. We're gonna go to the facial doctor and we are going to get this done. So let's go! The makeup is washed off. Hello, Cowlix. Love the Cowlix. I also love that it looks like I literally have a mullet right now. Hey there, partner! All right, let's go. We're here and I'm scared. I mean, took these pictures of my face and my acne and we're gonna fix that.
I look like I just look like I have a sunburn, but yeah. Okay, but look at that glow. Oh my goodness. It's just glowing. <laughs> Words so loud. Well. Ah, I guess. What a glow. What a glow. What a glow. <laughs> All right, oh my gosh. So today is the morning after I got my vampire facial. And okay, I'm right in the natural lighting. I, look at that. Like I'm not really supposed to see a result till like two to three days after, basically up to five days. So this is like, <laughs> My skin has never felt softer. It has never felt softer. So, mm, as of right now, I am giving this vampire facial a solid 10 out of 10, period. Trungle, buddy. Hello. Say hi. Woof. Cute pup. So yeah, the experience yesterday was actually super amazing. He wants, <laughs> he wants to be in the video. Okay, let's put the camera here. Oh. Oh, buddy. Can you sit right next to me? Can you sit here? <laughs> oh, buddy. No, but it was really, really great. I mean, they taught me so much about the vampire facial. Basically what they did is they took blood out of my arm, right? So then after they took my blood, they spun it and it took like about 10, 15-ish minutes. And then um, they took like the blood and the plasma and they like rubbed it all over my face and they took a very thin micro needle and they just drew a bunch of circles around my face, which was absolutely the strangest feeling ever. But I would highly recommend this to anyone. Like it's truly amazing. Okay, but here's like another close-up of my face. Wow. Someone wants to play with their pineapple. It took about two hours. Oh my gosh. So they put this insane numbing cream on my face. Kind of hated it, but kind of loved it at the same time. I couldn't feel my lips for about 12 hours. So that was fun. So they put this thick layer of numbing cream on my face. They let it sit on my skin for about an hour. And then after that is whenever they took my blood and spun it and then zhuzhed it over my face with the micro needle. And the micro needling part took about 15, 20 ish minutes. And then I kind of had to like sit for a second because they didn't want me to pass out <laughs> before I left. And I didn't. I was fine. And then I left and it was great. And the service was wonderful. All of the women were incredible. If you were thinking about getting a facial or have really bad acne problems in general, I would highly, highly, highly recommend that you get this vampire facial because honestly, my skin has never felt or looked better. So 10 out of 10. Okay, so it's been officially five days since my vampire facial. And the texture of my skin, I'm sure you can't tell just by looking at it. The texture is very different because I can, I, I feel it and it feels so much smoother and softer. I mean, I really, really love how minimal acne I have. It's definitely like, I, I can't even compare this to how like my skin was before. Like I used to have discoloration. I had really horrible red marks around my mouth and I feel like it has gone down a lot and my skin tone is just a lot more even. But I don't know, what do you guys think? I know it's only been five days and it takes six weeks for the whole process to pretty much be done. But what do you guys think? I mean, I personally would get a vampire facial again. I would like to get one once a year if possible. Um, but I am really happy. And I think that that is the most important thing is I love the way that my skin looks and I hope you do too. But thank you for joining me on this journey. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, I will definitely post weekly updates of my skincare journey um, because this is something that is very important to me. So definitely follow along. Let me know what you guys want to see next on my channel. I am definitely open to anything and everything. So let's have fun. And I will talk to you very shortly. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye.